Sure enough, just as the angel had said. Nine months later, Mary was almost ready to have her baby. In those days, Caesar Augustus issued a decree that a census should be taken of the entire Roman world. This was the first census that took place. Cunus was given an census. Yeah, Cunus. And everyone went to their own town to register. So Mary and Joseph had to take a trip to Bethlehem. The town King David was from. While they were there, the time came for the baby to be born. Every room was full. Every bed was taken. Joy! And King was taught. Oh, there isn't any place for you. Where would they stay? Soon Mary's baby would come. They couldn't find anywhere except an old tumble-down stable. So they stayed with the cows. And the donkeys. And the horses stayed. And they're in the stable. And once the chickens. And the donkeys. And the sheep. In the quiet of the night. So she gave birth to her firstborn, a son. God has given the world his wonderful gift. The baby that would change the world was born. The son. So Mary and Joseph wrapped him up in cloth to keep him warm. They made a soft bed of straw. And they used the animals for eating trough of his cradle. And they gave him wonder at God's great gift. Wrapped in father and go. I'm in the manger. Mary and Joseph named him Jesus. Emmanuel. Which means God has come to live with us. Because of course he has.